Well, cheers, my new buckaroos. I am Tom the Beer Whisperer. My phone had updates today and just uh, automatically started updating when I was in the middle of something. <laughs> anyway, now uh, they've changed all the functions on my camera. It took me forever to find the new little icon on it. Uh, they've changed all the functions. Now, just when I get used to how something works, you can't mess with old people like that. Uh, <laughs> we want things to work the way it used to, man. Uh, every time there's an update to make something simpler, it makes my life harder, man. So anyway, <laughs> so I've got this one here. Uh, I actually had one last night to do a live video, but I didn't do a video for my YouTube channel. So here we go. Pulaski Pills, Chicago Pilsner, Dry Hot Pilsner from, 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 Maplewood Brewing out of Chicago, Illinois. Grain is Pilsner in Vienna. Hops are Santium and Warrior. Vitals, Lager, 4 SRM, 25 IBUs, 5.1%. So there you go. This is obviously an American style Pilsner. Why am I not? Why aren't you using a Pilsner glass, Tom? There's a perfectly good reason for that, because I grabbed the wrong beer. I, was gonna, I meant to grab the. See, I drank one of these last night to do live video, so I was going to grab the other beer that I, I, I bought two flavors. I was going to grab the other one to do another live video tonight. But I grabbed this one by mistake, and I didn't realize that, even though the cans are completely different, mind you. <laughs> I didn't re realize it until I popped it open and started pouring and noticed the color wasn't a brown ale. That's the lightest brown hair I ever see. Anyway, uh, so I figured, what the hell? <laughs> uh, when life pours you the wrong beer, drink it anyway. Uh, yeah, what the hell? Need to do a video anyway. I just, you know, I was going to do the other beer. I love the aromas on this. Uh, the nice bready, uh, you know, uh, Pilsner malts, along with those the. Nice herbal and earthy notes from the hops here. It just makes a, a nice beer. And then I gotta admit, though, I have been craving a Pilsner a lot lately. I've been I've bought a few, uh, a few, about a couple uh, craft Pilsners lately, just because of, uh, you know, kind of a mix them in between the the, the bigger beers that I've had handy. Uh, it's just a nice change of pace. And although I'm not a fan of, of, of macro lagers and Pilsners. A good, uh, honest to goodness Pilsner, just like they used to make <laughs> before breweries decided to use cheap craft. You know, there is something just, just refreshing about them. So it's nice to see craft breweries actually going back to their roots and, and, and just making classic beer styles again. Oh, that's gorgeous. The finish on this is just exquisite. Again, uh, the, the flavors, uh, those big bready slash biscuity malts uh, uh, combined with those nice, oh, that finish is incredible. The nice kind of earthy herbal-like finish. It's just a beautifully done beer, man. It's impeccable. This was is, this is the first beer. Well, the second technically, I guess, has, but the first style beer I've had from Maplewood Brewing. Uh, so there you go. I'm impressed. We're doing some fine stuff. I, I, I am. Oh, boy, that's good. I need the beer. It was a long day today. It's been a long week, man. It's a Friday as I do this video, and I just found out that I need to. I don't typically work Saturdays, but I got to go in and do a few things tomorrow. Uh, which is okay. I don't necessarily mind. I just didn't know till today I was going to have to do it. <laughs> But it's not going to stop me from having a beer or two this evening. Because, you know, I'm no quitter. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, Maplewood, uh, this is a darn fine beer. So if you can find it, buy it. Pulaski Pilsner. Pulaski Pil, Chicago Pilsner, it says. Anyway, get the name right, Tom. Cheers, I am Tom Beer Whisper. Beer Vangelist, Believe Beer Drinker. Purr, Beer Whisper Man. Ah, cheese biscuits, that's good. All right, good guy. Remember, folks, life is serious. Beer shouldn't be.